Uh, so you flew in Friday and uh, coming off the bench for about like 40 minutes, like 35 minutes, like 30, something like that. 30, 30. How did it feel to be out there uh, with this team? Feels good. It's hard because uh, I didn't play for a little while. I think we saw it tonight in the last, we said at the last boost. I did I lack some energy at the end, but it's nice to be in this team and to be able to play. What's it like playing with a, uh, such a world-class striker like Thierry Henry? Uh, it's nice because you know that uh, he is intelligent and experienced enough to adapt in function of what you do. And he's capable of changing the, the game by himself. So, yeah, it's always a pleasure to play with players. Like that. From the bench, what did you see in the first half after uh, the team went up by a goal? I think what we were missing maybe was some craziness, maybe a little bit in the second half, even if it was not perfect. I think we we had more soul and more energy in what we did. And I think that's what you need because even if you play good, you need this extra spice to be able to make the difference. What's the difference between um, Kansas City and uh, the Rebels? Uh, I've been here for one day, <laughs> 24 hours, so it's a bit early to answer. So. <laughs> what do you think of the crowd here? Nice, nice. I mean, they, they were so very so that nice nice with me. I mean, they welcomed me. And uh, even if it was not perfect, I hope that they're going to be satisfied with what I do and most importantly, what the team will do. Um, I know this is probably not something you have an opinion on, but there's been a lot of trades within this team over the last uh, few weeks. And the team changed a lot from the beginning of the season. Um, do, you, do you think where the team is now? that they deserve to go to the playoffs? I mean, obviously you followed like what's, what's happened over the last few weeks. Yeah, um, it's my team now. So yeah, we deserve to go to the playoffs. <laughs> it's my team now. All right, fair enough. Uh, did you get any phone calls from uh, national team fr uh, teammates of Guadalupe? Did they ask you, you know, what's Henri like? You know, how is it being in New York now? Did they ask you any questions? Uh, not that much. I mean, they were happy for me because they knew my situation. I was not really playing. Um, happy because it's a good challenge to come and play with the Red Bulls. Happy because I was going to be with another Guadalupean. <laughs> but, I mean, nothing more than that. We are footballers, so I mean, it's just the job. Well, welcome to New York. Welcome to victory for you guys, or is it, you know, just tie number 13? Um, I don't think so because all we were looking for this game was to get three points any way we could, and uh, we weren't able to do that at home. So it does, it, there's not really a good vibration. You know, Hans was saying this was a good performance. This could be a turning point kind of game. And to you, it's kind of drop points. Well, actually, after listening to that comment, I think he's right. <laughs> he's right. Actually, um, we did good. We did a lot of positive things. We created a lot of chances, but. I still feel like we're, um, we're trying to cross the ball too much instead of going direct through the middle toward the goal at least, you know, driving at somebody through the middle. Oh, no, go ahead, sorry. I didn't have anything else. Oh. So. One, um, oh, it's more over there. This is your first full senior season. Has this sort of gone the way you expected it to this year? Um, the season? Um, Just as a whole from a club perspective? As a whole from a club perspective? I mean, I'm improving and stuff, and I'm, I feel like I'm helping out the team any way I could, and that was my goal at the beginning of the season. I mean, of course, I like to get more playing time. But do you time. think that the team as a whole is expecting the way you thought it would this year? Is performing the way you thought it would? Um, I mean, if you look at our record, I don't think we deserve that record. Because of the style and the way that we play, we play good football. But, um, yeah, I mean, you can't be too happy looking at uh, the record that we have. Are you playing as much as you think you should? Um, I'm just uh, trying to get on the field any way that I could. I mean, it just means working harder. Then it's pushing me. It's pushing me in practice. It's pushing me in, uh, in training and stuff. And maybe it's making me better. Next one. How many of those chances in the second half? You thought you probably had a goal. A lot. I mean, even the first half when I was watching the games, we had so many chances to get a goal. I mean. It's tough. It's tough, I feel, with the slick surface and the rain. And I feel we got to notice that crosses weren't working, so we might as well penetrate through the middle.
How frustrating is it right now that you just can't seem to get the full three points? Or maybe even just hold a lead uh, to get into the second half because you're tying all the time. Yeah, it's, it's pretty frustrating just to have so many chances and to you know play such good football and you know, come out with three points that we've been looking for for the past in the month. Do you feel that maybe even though you did end in a draw, maybe it's a positive draw that you can probably work on this now when you go up to New England on next Saturday? I mean, Hans, uh, Hans said that, but I don't feel like there could be, no matter what, a positive draw at home. Um, this is our house, and we have the supporters behind us, and it should give us an extra boost. It did, but we just weren't able to put it between the posts. Thanks. So, Stefan. Uh